Hey guys, my name is Sediak and welcome back to an episode of Pilot Training Flight Simulator here on Roblox. Where boys, recently they brought out a new update and I checked out the brand new aircraft. And I am a, such a damn fool because I literally completely ignored the fact that they added in refueling tanker planes. And you can now fly planes and mid-flight you can now refuel your planes. How did I miss that? I am blind. Well, I'm back again, boys, and I'm going to be checking out this uh, these brand new tanker planes right now. Your boy, with the help of your boy JJ, who's going to be helping your boy out a little bit later, refueling them. But when you go to the aircraft spawner, there's a whole section for tankers. I am either blind or stupid or both. I don't know. I I'll let you guys decide in the comment section down below. But I want to check this out. I want to see these new tanker planes. Now, apparently, they're planes that you can fly. And then you fly high into the sky, they have fuel on board, and then a plane flies behind it and then is able to then refuel itself from your tanker plane. What? I know. But if you do enjoy this, smash that like button down below. Subscribe if you are new around here, boys, so you get notified when more episodes do come out. But um, let's check these out right now. Now, there's a couple to choose from by the looks of it. There is the A330 MRTT, uh, there is the KC-130J, and the KC-767. Wow. Now, all these look pretty good. you got a basic A330, uh, basically the, the 767. Usual standard planes, obviously kitted out to contain uh, lots of fuel on board and all that kind of jazz. A little bit different to your regular passenger plane right now. There's all kind of lights and stuff and beeps and boops on the inside. Can I look on the inside, like, through the actual... Look at this. Look at this. It's like beds and stuff. It's like some kind of like military jet, isn't it? It is kind of looking pretty crazy. Uh, we've got this one, which is, you know, looking, uh, you know, it's crazy to even see it right now. It is legit crazy to even see it. I got another tank on the KC. Uh, oh, we've got to clear the pad first. Let me let me go spawn in a different pad. Hold on. Hold on, boys. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, we go spawn in a different pad. Tankers, uh, 767, which is looking even more juicy now. This has got no windows whatsoever. And you look inside right now; it's all pure and complete cargo, from what you can kind of see. Uh, it does have a, it does have a couple of seats, but those seats have no windows, so you are literally you cannot see nothing on your flight, which is kind of crazy. But the one I'm most excited about is the Game Pass one, because when they throw a Game Pass on a plane, you kind of like, okay, what's going on here, boys? What's going on here? And uh, from what I can see, uh, the Game Pass one, the uh, KC-130J, these two planes, they kind of drop a little bit of a rod. You can see the refueling rod at the back. They drop the rod down, and then your plane flies behind it and sucks it up. Same with this one. You can see the rod at the back of that one as well. It's a little bit smaller. Uh, but this one over here, boys, this one's a little bit different. Now, this one doesn't drop the rod. It doesn't drop a rod down. What it does drop from the tankers is a long funnel where you have to kind of, like, fly the plane into the back of it to kind of suck it all up, which is kind of crazy. Now, I want to check both of these out. I want to see how both of these work and how you actually drop down uh, the refueling nozzle. So let's try this one first. Oh, there's your boy JJ right now with the refueling trick. <laughs> <laughs> Luckily, him right now, the damn phone. Um, I'm gonna pilot this, and if I go to controls, now it's called the is it is, is it called the drogle? The dro extend the boom, extend the drogle. Uh, I I, I drogle drogu. How do I pronounce it, guys? I'm terrible with pronunciations, but you, I don't think you can do any of it unless you're flying. Let me turn the engine on. You can't do any of it unless you're actually low-key flying. That's all you can do. You actually can't refuel the planes themselves. So I think that I think these planes technically have like some form of like an infinite fuel. But if I try and fly, and we're gonna go and see right now what happens. I'm gonna I'm gonna completely ignore all the laws and physics of using a runway. But I want to see this extend down, and then what I want to do is go and find the game uh, fly the, the the game pass plane. All right, wait for the plane to get into the air. Now, if I get rid of the landing gear, how high have I got to go to extend them? Is there an altitude? Is there a height? Is there a speed that we've got to go to? Oh, there you go! How weird does that look? It, I ain't gonna lie, it does kind of low-key look weird. It looks really weird, doesn't it? It looks really weird, but it's kind of cool, isn't it? It is low-key. You can't argue that that is actually pretty cool right now. Um, can I turn around? How do I then retrieve it back? Oh, there you go, boys. There you go. Extends back. And... Oh, there's the booms! Hold on. There they are. So you can do both on these planes. You can legit do both. You can drop down 
the booms and the the, the, the drogu drogu i feel like i'm saying it wrong uh and you can refuel them from both sides so you can technically refuel three planes at once with this you really could but the game plus one is what I'm excited about more than anything. So I'm going to turn around right now. I'm going to try and land back down. It's probably not going to go right. Probably not going to go right. And we're going to go check out the other one. So coming in hot and heavy, boys. Hot and heavy. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Are them planes still there, by the way? No, they've actually despawned themselves. Right, your boy JJ's got a jet. So he might be able to actually refuel on my plane. But I'm going to spawn in the other one. The Game Pass one. This could be pretty interesting. So, tankers... KC-130J, and we're going to jump in this real quick. So, pilot this. Now, this looks a little bit different on the inside as well. It just looks pretty cool. We can turn the engines on. Now, this is an old-school propeller one as well, so this is going to be pretty interesting. Um, now, this, by the looks of it, doesn't have the big stick thing that hangs down. Uh, the boom, as they call it. But I'm going to try and fly right now into the sky. And I don't know if there's like a certain altitude that we need to drop. Is it M or N? It's M. Is there an altitude that it only gets dropped on? 300 feet. Right, 500 feet. Okay, 500 feet. It's now coming out. Look at this, boys. Look at how good this looks. Now, it doesn't have the boomstick that comes down. And uh, your boy JJ's having a little bit too much fun right now. So I might need to get this damn fool to fly the plane. And then I fly behind him and see if I can refuel my plane. Yeah, this is so good. This is probably one of the best new features that they've implemented in the game right now. It really is. Right, let's do some refueling, boys. So, I've had to now enlist the help of an Australian. I know, guys, the place is not real. But your boy JJ right now has got the big tanker plane, and he's now going to taxi to the runway, uh, take off, deploy the refueling, and I'm going to try and attempt to fly behind him right now and see how easy it is to actually refuel my own plane. So I'm going to turn my own jet on right now. Um, I'm ready for this. I actually already have, like, you know, max fuel anyway. But uh, it should be pretty interesting. So he's now going to taxi to the runway. We'll kind of slowly go behind him. And just kind of let him do what he's got to do. And then once I see him deploy the refueling nozzles, hoses, whatever you want to call them, I'm going to try and fly behind <laughs> and strategically place myself in the position to fill up my own tanks. This is probably the first time where I've actually taxied correctly to a runway. This is hilarious. Yo, I think that boy's speeding right now. He just kind of gained a little bit of speed. Let me try and catch him up slightly. <laughs> Trying to outdo me right now? I'm in a goddamn jet. Now, at this point, it's obligatory to say cabin crew seats for departure, even though there's no cabin crew. Uh, but your boy JJ right now is about to uh, disappear into the sunset. I have to then chase him down. Now, i got to remember, I'm in a jet. I can't go too quick. But he is now about to... Um, to um, depart the area uh, in his uh, refueling plane right now, and I will shortly be following him behind. So I give him a little bit of leeway. I give him a little bit of space to kind of uh, get slightly ahead of me, because that plane's going to be a lot slower than mine. It's 100% going to be a lot slower than mine, so I need to give him a little bit of distance just so we can kind of try and maintain the speeds. Not quite sure what height he's going to go to or what speed he's going to go to right now, but that will be all part of the fun, right? I can see him now just flying off into the distance. Off into the sunset, boy. Off into the sunset. So I could go for it right now. I can kind of go maximum speed. And then watch my jet slowly take off. There we go. There we go. There we go. And now we almost have to hunt your boy down. We almost now have to hunt him down. But not too quick, boys. Not too quick right now. And um, we're going to try and refuel our own plane. Now, in the meantime, we're going to be burning fuel. And I think he's going to get some quite some altitude as well. Let me kind of slow down a little bit because I'm, I'm really catching him up. I'm really catching him up right now to the point where I'm probably catching him up a little bit too quick. But we're about 2,000 feet, which is glorious. And I think I might be catching him up a little bit too quick right now. But actually, no, this is probably perfect. This is probably perfect. So, gonna wait for him to hopefully deploy. I'm on land speed right now. Let me kind of increase my throttle. Right, this is the difficult bit right now, is trying to get just behind him just right. Right, I'm gonna try and increase my speed slightly. There we go. Maybe bring it down. I actually don't know where the po So we jumped from like 190 to 176, which is kind of crazy. Now, what's the button to kind of hold altitude again? I always forget. Uh, it, it, it's R. Right, sweet, sweet. So oh, okay. He's released the refueling nozzles. I'm going to press R to hold my altitude. I'm now holding altitude. Oh, yeah, my landing gear. Boys, what's going on? I didn't have my landing gear away right now. Right, I'm going to increase my throttle slightly. 
We're gonna slowly hone him in right now and catch him up. Am I getting closer? We're getting closer. We are getting closer. Now my fuel has barely moved. It's like a very, very minuscule amount that it's kind of then moved. But I'm getting closer right now on the approach. Right. Hold on, hold on. Oh, 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 oh. Easy, boy. Easy, easy, easy right now. I'm trying to hold it. I'm trying to hold it right now. It's a lot more difficult than you expect. It's a lot more difficult than you expect to kind of get this perfect. Ah! Oh, come on, boy. Come on. I feel like I might have gone slightly past it. That is, it's very difficult. Let me kind of slow down just a tad. It's a lot more difficult than you expect. It really, really is right now. A lot more difficult than you expect. So let me try and gain a little bit more speed. Easy. Easy, boys. Easy right now. Come on. Come on. It's so difficult to try. I've, I've, now, I've, now I've completely overshot it. Now I've completely overshot it. Right. I'm a fool. I'm a fool. Now there's nothing else I've got to also press is there. Hooks that's launched by. Is it the Q? Right, let me get a little bit closer. Hold on. Hold on. I'm almost there. I'm just trying to get myself a little bit, a little bit closer, boys. A little bit closer. It's a lot more difficult than you expect, is all I can say. It's a lot more difficult than you expect it to be. Very difficult, boys. Very difficult right now. So I'm not going to lie, guys. I'm kind of an idiot. I didn't realize I had infinite fuel enabled. Kind of would help if your boy actually used some fuel right now. So I'm now flying back up to your boy, JJ. <laughs> Who literally just called me a damn fool uh, to try and now refuel myself. So he's now gonna fly. Uh, well, he's now flying. I gotta slow my speed right down again. I gotta slow my speed right down again because I now need to match his airspeed so I can refuel. It's a lot harder than it sounds, boys. It's a lot harder than it sounds right now. So he's just here, and even still at this speed right now, me trying to reduce it, I will probably end up catching him up. Yeah, look at that. I am way too quick for him right now way too quick for him all right bring this speed down a little bit and we're gonna go in for the kill i sound evil when i say that but i'm going in for the kill boys all right where's his plane wait has he just died i've just lost my refueling plane right so take 27 <laughs> but we should be okay this time now cruising at 2000 feet i'm slowing down now right behind him in the process i've also used a lot of fuel so now he's got the refueling all set up. I need to gain a little bit more speed. I've got to try and now gauge my speed just right. Seven, 179 knots is what I'm now doing. Is this enough to catch him? I think I'm slowly catching him. Yeah, I'm slowly catching him right now. So I'm going to speed up a little bit. And then we'll kind of drop it back down shortly. And that gave me a little bit of a boost. I feel like I'm maybe slightly losing a little bit of altitude to him. But no, we're honing him in. We are honing your boy in right now. Bring that throttle down. Maybe up a little. I'm trying to find the right balance to get it just right. It's a lot more difficult than it looks. Now, look at my fuel, boys. My fuel is now going up. I am technically... All you got to do is get within the vicinity of it. I am now technically refueling, boys. I'm now technically refueling. Hang on, slow down, boys. Slow down, slow down. Slow down right now. Slow down. But well, I'm technically refueling. It doesn't suck it like uh, you would think it would suck it. But I, I refueled, baby. So this is like an infinite fuel glitch. Kind of, almost. <laughs> Which is hilarious. Which is actually kind of hilarious. Well, I did it, boys. I have just refueled on the plane. And then off. I can go a million miles an hour. You gotta admit, boy, that's gotta be the, one of the greatest new features to pilot training flight simulator ever right now. The fact that you can now refuel your planes mid-flight the journeys we could make the fuel we could reburn the excitement that is now beholding to us absolutely glorious so jj i appreciate it i appreciate you uh oofing the plane but there we go boys if you did enjoy this smash that like button down below you want to see more pilot training flight simulator on the channel then make sure you do subscribe so you get notified when more episodes do come out but until next time i will see you all soon so good bye